Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. You're watching Old Car Auto Guy. Today is Sunday, so we've got to head down to the Civic Center and grab the two vehicles that we had down there, the 14 Rogue and the 14 Kia Soul, and get them out before they start uh, getting upset that we left them behind. And the reason is, is because the Civic Center staff uh, needs to get all that equipment out so that the company that came in and put up all the curtains and, uh, and all that stuff can come in tomorrow and strip it all out of there. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm just heading out to the shop right now and grabbing a couple of dealer tags. And that way we can uh, get the cars from the Civic Center to the shop legally. And we don't have to worry about uh, not being compliant with the law. Also, once we get back from the Civic Center and delivering those cars back to the lot, today is a perfect day although it's a little bit overcast to get some of that sound deadening done in the old Chrysler. It's uh, 71 degrees out so I think we're going to take advantage of that this afternoon and maybe we'll get the interior part finished up and start putting the interior back together in hopes that I can start driving the car real soon. So I guess that's on the agenda for today and uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to video that because you've seen how I've done it and uh, whatnot so we'll just uh, update you on it once we get it done. All right, we're here at the shop. And just in case it's not warm enough out, we're gonna grab the heat gun so we can take this and uh, heat that stuff up, that sound deadening product, real good. Keys. There we go. That would not have been fun. So over the last couple of days, um, looking across the way, I have noticed a lot of traffic around that uh, 2011 Crown Vic Police Interceptor. And guess what? She gone. So I guess if I really want one, I've got to go to the auction and find one. But at least that one over there won't be tempting me anymore. And I was tempted. All right guys, it is Sunday afternoon and we've got the cars back to the shop, no problem. Picked up the heat gun and man, what a difference the heat gun makes trying to get this Dynamat to lay down and stick to the floor. So Junior and I just finished up and uh, we managed to get the back half of the interior done. So take a look. We got her all in, all taped up, right up to the trunk lid there. And the uh, trunk will be the next project someday. I'm pretty excited because now we can start getting the interior back in the car. And once that's done, I can start driving this baby. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to just tinker away at getting the interior back in. You never know, we just might get that done today this old guy has enough energy left though.
And once and for all, the interior is back in it. Now all that's left is to go for a ride. shenanigans. <laughs> I gotta go back and check this burnout. <laughs> oh goodness. Maybe we'll let him do one more. One more. That's my boy. <laughs> home. 